Hello there, and as usual, I'm Aaron from Last Stand Gamers, and welcome. So the other day, the concept of hacking came up in the comments of one of my videos, and I looked on, reading through, and I was very intrigued. Now, the idea that someone can come along, simply connect up for a merge block or a connector, and simply steal your ship is absolutely ridiculous. And there is some basic countermeasures you can take in place to actually stop this from happening. Now, imagine you're in the midst of a battle, you've left your connectors on for some reason, and then the next minute some small vessel connects on up and disables all your weapon systems. This is the sort of thing that can really play to the advantage of the enemy. And even worse, once they're connected into the system, they don't even need to be aboard your ship. They can simply, from the outside, access, turn on, turn off systems, and the faster you try to turn things off, they're going to be turning them on. Now, there is one very simple way of solving this problem, and it is the simple unplug method. If you turn off your merge blocks and you turn off your connectors, there is no way they can connect in from the exterior. So they would have to literally come in and activate them blocks. So that is one of the first countermeasures. Now, as this game develops, I'm sure there'll be more safety countermeasures put in place. Maybe there'll be a faction sort of system where only the units from the same faction can connect onto their merge blocks, or maybe there'll be some sort of password keypad that we see on a lot of the doors or there'll be some similar method. Now, since this is such an easy way into the ship, we need to develop some sort of ship that can actually exploit this while we can. Now, we need to get in there and steal as many items as we possibly can. Now, people have spent absolutely ages collecting these items, and if you're a willing pirate, you can have a field day in stealing their supplies. One large cargo container, a few minutes, and you've just emptied their whole entire ship. Or maybe you're if a little bit more braver, you connect up to a merge block and you decide to take their ship for a joyride with them aboard. Now, these are two very simple ships that I'm going to show you here. Now, the first one is a supply stealing vessel. This one is designed very sort of stealthy, very sort of tight, very sort of small, low profile. So we can get in there, activate your connector without you knowing. Now, obviously, if you had it off, it wouldn't be able to do so. So that is something you really want to take into consideration. So as it's activated, it's sucking up all your supplies and it's emptying your ship and your hard-earned work. Now the second sort of hacking ship is the, the basically call, I call it the controller. It's the idea of that this little pod becomes the new command center of your ship and it does this by simply locking you out of your own system. For instance, you might connect up, you'll close all the doors down, you'll close all the systems, that's going to make it really hard for them to move around their ship. And while they're trying to access the door panels and move around, get back up to the control panel, you're simply flying away with the whole ship, and you've basically captured maybe a whole crew of a vessel. And as long as you manage to get in there undetected, you've got quite a nice little task ahead of you, simply pirating that away and selling off the crew maybe to some unwanted, suddenly dodgy mercenary trader of some, some dodgy far-out galaxy. But apart from that, it's a very interesting concept, and I'd really love to see what you guys want to do with it. So I'm going to give you a quick warning about some of the ways pirates may use this system to hack into your ship. Now, the first is the pirate station. Now, this looks quite simple. It looks quite a reliable sort of station, and it's got a merge block on it. And people always seem that they want to connect for some reason with these merge box and dock with another vessel. But in this case, it would be a bad idea. Because this ship is actually a pirate station. Now, this pirate station will actually disable your control panel and other areas and not allow you to leave your command room. Why it literally takes over, connects up and flies off with your vessel. And that is not what you want. So you're coming in this situation like so, you come into dock with it, you're like, oh, what's aboard here? Or maybe you're even thinking, oh, I could steal something off this station. What a great idea. So it connects up with you. Now the next minute, the actual station is in fully control of your ship. It's locked down all your doors and you're basically a prisoner of your own ship. And whoever's aboard that little ship has just won themselves a big prize. So if we take this to a little bit of a next level, we have the possibility of maybe even connecting up and when the factions is released, changing the alliance of the ship. So a ship that is now maybe in the center of the fleet has just been pirated, hacked, and now it's targeting all the close by vessels and destroying it, creating a situation that would be absolutely hilarious to watch, but would absolutely be awesome to see if that would actually happen. Anyway, that was just some food for thought for today, and I thought you guys might want to hear about my opinion on that concept. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.